Life, man, jeez. So, such an honor to be here at the Birdland, such history here. Thank you, Jim, for having us. And uh, we uh, left the rest of the band at home tonight. So it's just us. And that's the way I wanted it. Um, yeah, it wasn't always easy getting to the Broadway the first time around, and uh, so grateful to be honored uh, by my community with the Tony nomination and all that, with Rock of Ages and I uh, we made some notes here of the song we uh, <laughs> just added. And I, uh, I'll be back here actually next month with, with Frank Wildhorn, a dear friend of mine, a great composer. We uh, got to do Jekyll and Hyde together, of course, and the composer of so many great shows. Um, just got to revive Jekyll and Hyde for a few weeks down south, and it just, it was really hard. Uh, hard on me. Uh, it's a great show, but. Uh, beats the hell out of my body, so. I got a seven-year-old to do most of that now, so. Um, this is a little song for you guys um, from one of Frank's shows. Hopefully this will stay on. What I learned about this song is a uh, beautiful show, Civil War, and uh, a lot of the show was comprised of actual letters and letters that they found from, from the Civil War, from soldiers to their loved ones, uh, vice versa. And this one song um, is based on this letter, the soldier who took a, a gunshot to the gut. And I guess they used to carry a pencil and a paper with them so they could write their loved ones just in case. Because back then, you're pretty fucked if you have a, a gunshot to the gut. Um, this song is based on uh, on that letter. I think it's beautiful, but I don't remember it as well. And I surprised Josh with it tonight. So <laughs> let's see. Oh, Sarah, my Sarah, I fear I must go and leave you to move on. Alone, a heart that is rising and fixing to blow and scatter the thoughts we have known. I love you, I love you, my 
Be there.